to Hillary Clinton's email scandal. DNC Chair Debbie Wasserman Schultz weighing in. Roll that tape. Yes, it's gotten a little vulgar on the GOP side, but no one's th facing the threat of indictment. There's no one th facing the threat of indictment on our side either, Megan. They're, they're There's an open DOJ and FBI focus. investigation into Mrs. Clinton right now. Right. Let's not be melodramatic. We, we How have is that melodramatic? Those are the facts. Who, <laughs> well, predicting that there's someone who fa is facing indictment is definitely there was no prediction. Not a good idea, in my opinion, to say uh, don't be melodramatic to Megyn Kelly. <laughs> don't do that. <laughs> uh, uh, Leslie Marshall, I think uh, she was in a corner, um, Debbie Wasserman Schultz. I think she's spinning. I think there is the threat of indictment hanging over Hillary Clinton, but she can't say otherwise, can she? Uh, no, I don't agree with that. Um, actually, I don't think she answered that properly. And quite frankly, in her position, uh, she really should have said there's an investigation. You know, we shouldn't speak on that. And we certainly are hopeful that all questions will be answered. And I don't believe an indictment will be put forth. Neither do I. I think that this was politically irresponsible, personally irresponsible. But that's not criminal negligence. And that does not uh, warrant an indictment. And legal experts uh, tend to agree with that. But when you've got all these FBI investigations and we hear all about That's normal, it. though. Remember, you have to have an investigation to get to a certain level to but, be able to yes. to be able to subpoena people to say that and to be able to side, question people under oath. Nobody is under the threat of indictment. I mean, come on. Well, There's I, three I, investigations right now. Yeah. Right, but she, she's not going. She's not going to be indicted. I, I'll go to. Vegas but that's another that. story. I mean, here the head of it's the Democrat threat. Party mm -hmm. sort of saying, "Oh no, 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 don't be melodramatic." It's she may not be indicted. I don't know. She's in a court. Investigations, in investigations but... and there have been numerous on on politicians on both both party sides have not led to indictments historically. Mm -hmm. Not for anything like this. <clears throat> that could put our guys at risk. Uh, yeah. Senator Bernie mm -hmm. Sanders. He pulled off. Quite an upset in the Michigan primary last night. He won. Okay, it was a narrow victory over Hillary Clinton, but he won. What do you make of this? Well, a few things. First of all, we can't necessarily believe the polls. I know pollsters are slapping yeah, themselves today. I mean, she had a double-digit lead, which means did they and are they getting it wrong in the states going forward? Bernie can sigh, uh, you know, breathe a sigh of relief. The, the South's behind him. He might do very well in California, the Pacific Northwest, and states like that. But right now, Hillary Clinton still has more than half of the delegates needed sure. to be the nominee. She has more than double the delegates that he has. But what this showed me, and I was shocked at this, he did well in Dearborn, huge Muslim community, in Flint, with African Americans. He did much better. So quite frankly, I think that going forward, we're going to see a lot of Bernie supporters coming out and saying, this is our candidate, this is our guy, even though I'm a Hillary girl, I think they're going to fight to the bitter end. I do think Mrs. Clinton will be on that yeah, platform. He July. now has momentum, I think. Yeah, I agree. Got it I do agree with that's that. That's for sure. Yes. Uh, then there was Donald Trump. Uh, he took uh, three more states last night. And now we're looking ahead to Florida and Ohio. That is next Tuesday. This is very, very important. Leslie, I've got polls out this morning which show Donald Trump. It's a CNN poll. Mm. Look at that. CNN. This is Florida. Trump 40. Yes. Rubio 24. Now give me Ohio. We've got Trump 41 yeah. and we've got uh, Kasich at 35. In both cases, wow. key states, mm -hmm. Trump leads the home guy. I mean... What do, you, what do you say? <laughs> Come on. I say, I say that um, I see the fat lady in the wings and she's going to sing next week, I think. <laughs> what do you for, mean by uh, that? I, I think it's the cool game's like over that. for everybody but Donald Trump. I mean, Donald Trump will be the Republican nominee. My fellow liberal Democrats laughed at me when I said, you watch this guy will be the nominee. I live in a state where Arnold Schwarzenegger was my governor. So I've seen it before <laughs> and I, I see it again. Mm -hmm. And I think that celebrity and this like reality show type campaign that he's running obviously is very appealing to voters. And let me tell you something, they will, all these people talking against him, they will come out and support him and vote for him. Well, they, they've done it before and they will again. You're on the left, I'm not, but I think you're agreeing with my premise, which is if Donald Trump is not the Republican nominee, mm -hmm. for whatever reason he's aced out, if that happens, the Republican who is the nominee will not win. You agree? I don't think the Republican nominee is going to win either way. <laughs> okay. I don't think the Republican oh, nominee is going to win, especially if it's Donald Trump. So go, Donald, go. Um, uh, because uh, but then again, I, I, what Be poll can I believe? You, I can't, yeah. you may regret that. Uh, yeah. You could regret that. No, no, no. Oh, Don Democrat, Donald but... Trump will not be our president. I have more faith in my fellow Americans than that. <laughs> I'm a fellow American now. You realize that? <laughs> I know. Are you, are you, do you love Donald? You're... I didn't say that. Well, I said I'm a fellow American. Right. No, right. Uh, there we go. Fellow, 
rational mind to Republicans different than to me. Some I'm a very rational Trump guy, okay?